Okay, so I'm set up again uh, on M16, doing a two-minute exposure. I'm being as still as I can, so to not cause any vibration. There's obviously much, much less wind. I might have to take that off to also reduce vibrations. But this, I'm in the snowies and there is not another soul around for miles and it's dead quiet and dead black yeah, I don't think, oh that's Jupiter, he comes out but I don't think any of the other stars will come out but I can tell you that it is an absolutely fantastically black sky the moon's not yet risen we got Big Dipper sitting over there Jupiter and Sagittarius over here. Moon, I think you're coming up over there. But it is a fantastically black sky. This is the natural state of the universe. Black and very quiet. In fact, this is one of the most brightest this is one of the brightest places in the entire universe inside a galaxy and even at that even at that inside a galaxy the brightest places in the universe uh, relative <laughs> on the grand scheme of things and it's almost completely black you know, I mean you don't really appreciate it because you know we take daylight as the norm but it's not it's to be that close to a star is some insignificant fraction of the universe. Right, our exposure is finished of the Eagle Nebula. There he is. Eagle Nebula. So this is M16. And that is the thing, that's the Eagle, obviously. This is the thing that Hubble took all the pictures of. Of, and they're called the pillars of creation and the areas of star formation and one of those is the actual background on the Thunderfoot channel and for years as a kid I tried to see the Eel Nebula and failed um, and now just to take a picture of it like that in two minutes is fantastic and uh, triumph of modern technology and for those who thought my car was messy you have no idea so uh, here we have remnants of planes, zoos, controllers, cameras mouthwash and such like, battery chargers, laptop, and this is where I sleep. <laughs> uh, just about enough room to actually roll my feet over. Um, so I've just finished the uh, night out with the telescope. Uh, yeah, just thought I'd show you how I've really cramped. Uh, I mean, uh, admittedly I had to throw a load of this stuff in. Uh, you know, packing up the telescope, but I just thought I'd let you know how really crowded it is in here.